Good afternoon. Today is Wednesday, November 28th, 2018. I'm Ben Smold and Kenny County is having an election recount. We'll tell you why. And I'm Jane Beals. Everything is going planned on Mars. The news is next. Seniors, do you not love your senior photo? Good news. Senior retakes are tomorrow from 8 to 12 p.m. in the library. If you want to retake, be sure you stop by. Girls basketball is home again tonight. We play Caldwell and it's pajama night, so you get to dress really casual. The girls have been working hard and really appreciate your support. Tomorrow's snow team is having their second meeting. Come to A132 during lunch or after school to sign up and vote for your team captain. Deadline to join and turn in all your waivers forms is December 4th. Hurry up and join the chillest team on campus. Yearbook is in need of pictures and they are looking for pictures that include your pets and pictures of you at work. That's right, pictures of you at work. Snap a couple and contact Mr. Ewing or Corinne Clark if you have any questions or pictures. Come, show, come on Wildcats, show us where you go and where they pay you for being there. Skills USA meets tomorrow during advocacy. You can simply schedule Mr. Allen or Mr. Moffitt during advocacy and be in B204 to get signed up. Juniors and seniors interested in attending a college, an Idaho college that has scholarships for STEM students, there will be a presentation for you this coming Monday, December 3rd, during mentoring in the library. Today's activities, girls hoops at home versus Caldwell, boys basketball at Mountain Home and wrestling at Valley View. We'll be right back after this. Stop. Whether you're walking or driving, you need to follow the street signs. Every street sign is there for a reason, to help keep you safe near construction zones or allow you to get where you're going safely. Not only is it the law, it will keep you and your friends safe. Follow the rules of the road. Do you know when the breaks are? Well, November 19th through the 23rd is Thanksgiving break. Then on December 21st, we have a two-hour early release. Then December 24th through January 4th is Christmas break. And then the end of the first semester is January 17th, so make sure you're getting your grades. Today's weather is brought to you by Dr. Kim Keller. Your smile is your first impression. Make yours a great one and see Dr. Keller today. Today's weather is going to be frightful with a high of 46 and a low of 32. Back to you, Jane. Thank you. Uh, election... Election officials in Kenyon County will conduct a recount of votes today, three weeks after the College of Western Idaho Le levy was narrowly defeated at the polls. With more than 231,000 votes cast, the levy failed by just 144 votes. CWI officials want to build a health sciences building on the Nampa campus. They say the building will help fill the health gap skills in the Treasure Valley. NASA's InSight Mars lander has sent signals to Earth indicating that its solar panels are open and collecting sunlight on the Martian surface. NASA's Mars Odyssey orbiter relayed the signal which were received on Earth at about 5.30 p.m. PST. Solar array deployment ensures the spacecraft can recharge its batteries each day. Odyssey also relayed a pair of images showing InSight's landing site. InSight's twin solar arrays are each 7 feet 2.2 meters wide. When they're open, the entire yeah the entire lander is about the size of a big 1960s convertible. The panels are large because Mars has a weaker sunlight than Earth due to the fact it's much farther away than the Sun. The SAT word of the day is writhe, which means to twist or bending in pain. You could use it this way: When the quarter's back knee shattered, he fell to the ground and writhed. Thanks for watching and, and live, live the, the Wildcat wild way. way.